Hey guys, how you doing there? This is Joe and today I'm back with another game. This time it's another first person puzzle game, uh, which uh, if you know me well then you know I play a kind of a lot of these games. And uh, I guess I found a new one here. This is a very early prototype and it's called Fabric. And um, as far as I know it's like uh, just a very early prototype alpha. Um, I don't know much about it. I know it's all about manipulating blocks and things like that. So I'm just going to hit space and uh, I'm going to jump into fabric and see what it's all about. So, here we are. Got this crazy digital world, I guess. Cubes kind of all around us. Got a light cube there. Got a blue light. I wonder if the objective is to get to the blue light. Well, I guess it was at the start there. Alright. So I haven't got any tools yet, it doesn't look like I can ma manipulate any blocks at all. So uh, let's keep going. Okay, we can jump up, so that's how we learn the jump key. Looks like it's another case of like just getting from one section to the other, at least at the moment. So I guess we'll just keep making our way. Can I sprint? I don't think I can sprint. Alright, so far so good I guess. Something tells me it's probably going to get a little bit more complicated, but uh, for now we're doing... Oh god, what? Oh, so kind of those just merged. Oh, these two blocks merged. Oh, okay, so it's like a timer. Alright, that's interesting. Here we go. Alright, let's just keep climbing. What's that? Oh, we've got another one here. What is that? Oh, it's like bringing it up. Can I stand on here? I hope that's not going to crush me. Oh, wait, what? It's kind of on a timer, it seems. Um, very odd. I thought it came down lower before. Why is it not doing that now? Okay. Is it because I'm standing in a certain spot? Huh. Alright, well this one is confusing then I guess. Like it came down lower than that I thought. Okay, let's just watch it from this angle. Maybe we can get it. Oh, there it goes. So why is it I want to stand up there it doesn't come down that far? Like what is that about? Oh, okay. Huh, I wonder if it's because I'm standing on this these like blocks or something. So let's wait for that to fall. Now we'll run. Okay, we kind of made it on there. There we go. You kind of freeze. It's weird. I don't. I don't. I'm not, I'm not quite sure what that mechanic is. But uh, like when you stand in a certain spot, I don't know. But we've got it here anyway, so maybe we can figure it out a little bit more as we play. Okay, so we've got another one at the end there. Oh, okay. Looks like we're getting something here. What is this? Okay, so it's like... Oh! Fucking hell, the vibrator gun. I guess we can... What does that do? Oh wow, does that make a bridge? Oh, maybe I link them with the left. And then bring them together with the right. Oh, you have to shoot each side. Interesting. Alright. Not quite sure what the uh, right click does where it makes that vibrating noise. The inception gun. So I guess we'll do this again. Bring these together like so. Seems to be pretty straightforward, right? Okay, so now it's telling us to do right click. Oh, so it's a one-time thing. So 
I guess the right click just kind of like forces walls apart or something. I don't know. But uh, we're, pro we're progressing at least, so there is that. Alright, so let's see what we've got here. So we need to bring these two together, I guess. There we are. Oh, then is it a case of maybe separating them? Ah, oh, wow, yeah, that makes sense now. So you bring them together and it kind of... Com does it completely void what's in the frame? Ah, it does. It kind of removes that section of the world. And then when you do kind of right click it, you can like bring that section back. Alright. Oh fuck. Not alright. Oh god. Wait, what? What is this? Alright, this is an alpha and I guess I'm like... Continuously falling. What? And what is this a good thing? Come on. God damn it. Alright, you can hit refresh you can hit R and restart apparently. That's good to know. <laughs> what the hell? I didn't even see the hole in the ground, to be honest. Alright, let me right click that. Like right, there's nothing there. Alright, let's just jump over. Not quite sure what the deal was there, but whatever I guess. But you can restart by hitting R, so that's good to know. Let's bring these together, maybe? And bring those out. Um. Oh, that kind of works. Kind of. Nice! Awesome! Alright, so I'm starting to get a hang of this now. It's all about manipulating the red blocks. And uh, I guess it could get pretty confusing, but I'm actually enjoying the uh, the mechanics so far. Pretty pretty interesting. All right. Huh. Oh snap! What did I do? And that's interesting. How the hell am I supposed to get closer to this? Oh, maybe I need to do it with the one on the other side. Oh no. Hold on. Bring this one closer with the right click. No? Okay. Tell if there's anything back there. <laughs> the gun. Okay. I'm not entirely sure how, what I'm supposed to do on this one. Like, I can't click on anything. What am I missing? I can click that. But that doesn't do that doesn't do anything at all, right? So What? That is bizarre, man. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. This one is uh, pretty tricky. So what am I missing? Okay, let's bring those together, right? As far as I can tell, there's like nothing else anywhere. Oh, wow. Okay, so that worked. So you need to like do it from a distance. Alright. Man, this is <laughs> very confusing, but uh 
pretty good. I like it so far. Why do I feel like I'm missing something? Is that the exit? What is that? It's like a switch. Alright, so we have to go into the explo exploration mode now, I guess. Okay, so switches are a thing. So now we need to activate the switches to get out the levels, alright. That's one way of doing it. So we'll bring these together. Or not. Bring these together. Oh wow. This is interesting because now I need to actually hit the switch, then bring these together again. Oh, whoa! <laughs> um, and then separate them, and then go there. All right, <laughs> that made a little bit of sense, I guess. It does kind of make sense in a way, but it's uh. It's slowly kind of introducing the mechanics to you, so that's good. Can I... nothing around here? There's a section... oh, there's a section down there. Huh. Interesting. Kind of works. There we go. Awesome. So now we're getting to traversal, it's like going higher, it's not just all lengthways. So... Oh look, there's like an arrow pointing down, I've been missing like these signals this whole time. Possibly. So here is the goal. There is a switch. From what I can tell, there's like... Oh, screw it, I guess we'll go down. Ah, there it is. That's what I'm looking for. No, it's not gonna let me do this. Huh. Well, this sucks. Unless there's like a place down there I can go to. Hmm. So I can't. Screw it, let's go down. I may have made a mistake. So you actually do need to stand in a certain spot. Like, if you stand in a location where the worlds can't merge together, I guess it just kind of messes up. I can't see anything here. Oh god. Hmm. Okay. So we've completely got rid of like the section of the world that I need. So that is a thing. Wait, I feel like I'm like kind of stuck here. Like, what have I done? I can't actually do anything. Oh, it's that one. Here we go. That's what I needed to do. Nice. Took a while, but we actually got there in the end. It's like it's uh, really precise on where you can stand and where you can't stand. So. Like that's literally gonna trap me, I believe. Or not. Interesting. 
Okay, now it's getting trippy. Like, what the hell? Not sure what happened. One hundred percent need to do that. All right, and when you're in the red section, you can't. Oh, this is this is tough, man. Like when you uh, when you when you see red, you can't do anything. Oh yeah, I can do that. That well, that works. That works. Okay, I'm just gonna use these to teleport. Hit this and go back, and I should be able to get in. Ah, uh, yeah, I can actually ride that across then, I guess, alright? And then back in. Yeah, there we go! Nice! Get up there. There it is. Man, this is getting insane! Very unique gameplay, though. Well, I'm not even entirely 100% sure I understand what is uh, going on, but uh, we seem to be getting through slowly but surely, I guess. I'm standing on it, maybe. Oh, wow. What the hell? There's like loads of them. So I need to get to that switch first and foremost. Okay, that kind of works. Can I even get up there now? Can't get up there now, though. No. Can't do it. Maybe I can, like... Can't bring those together because I'm standing here or something. Can't bring those together. Huh. Interesting. This is crazy, man. You're just completely like folding worlds into each other and stuff. Uh. This one? No. That ain't gonna work. Bring this one down. No. Alright, let's push this one back. Ah, there we go. That's what I needed to do. Now it makes sense. There we go. Alright. That, that's good. And then we'll just need to bring this one down, right? So... Let's raise that back up. And then we need to figure out a way to get this one down. Can I get it from there? No. There. Sort of. There. Okay, something's gone terribly wrong. Like, the game has glitched out and I can't even move now. Like, my gun is at the top of the screen. No, God. Alright, alright. Wait, why am I high? What is going on? Something has gone terribly wrong. I can't actually move, by the way, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to like finish this. No, not going to let me do that. I need to reset. Like I can't even move. Something glitched out there, but uh, we can't. 
I think I need to bring this down on that section, right? So... Was it that section? Yeah, that works. So if I do that... Go up here, hit the switch. Hmm, is that because I'm standing here? Like, I can't tell. Possibly. I don't know. Huh. No. Alright. Let's try bringing that one across there. There we go. And then maybe... Do that. Nothing's working. Nothing is working. What is going on? All right, guys, this is where it gets complicated. I guess <laughs> I can't do that because I'm standing in the way. That one works. That's good. That works too. Why is nothing working now? Again, nothing. Go across, nope. Okay. Hmm. Alright, there. <clears throat> Alright, I've actually got rid of the whole thing now. That's not good. Alright, this is... <laughs> this is getting so complicated. So, we need to... <sighs> I wonder why we can't, I can't come down on that one there. That's what's confusing the shit out of me. Like, that is just not gonna happen. Nope. Nope. Can't do this from this side. Can't do it from this side. No. Ah, oh dear. Well... I guess this is a good example of how hard this game can get, or at least confusing. Maybe I need to like stand in like a certain spot. Oh, okay. Well, that worked, right? I don't know what's going on here. Hmm. This is, uh, this is crazy. Like, nothing makes any sense to me. I don't know why I can't bring that one down then. Now I can. Right, why can't I bring those across? That would help. Unless I need to like go up on this thing or something. Nope, I've kind of made myself stuck. Okay. I've like got rid of the world somehow. <laughs> what is going on, man?
maybe bring these across. All right, guys, this is uh, this is getting unbelievably tricky, and you can definitely see uh, how this can get. I mean, this is just insane. What? There we go. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. You can't actually just bring them down. Like I thought, I thought you couldn't like link them. When there was like there was three in a row, basically three red cubes. I thought you couldn't link the end and the last one together, but you actually can. Oh my god, that explains a lot. That explains a lot. All right, that was kind of my fault on that one, I guess, a little bit. I feel like uh, maybe I need to actually. This is going to probably involve me like completely running around. And then I need to come down here and hit it from this angle. Maybe? Unless you need to come and hit this one first. Why is that not letting me do that? These light blocks, I don't know if they actually mean anything or if it's just like an aesthetic thing, you know? Like, what? I wonder if I can like... Maybe I need to stand in like a certain location here. Because this is a big arrow. You can't fire as you jump, by the way. Why is that not letting me do that? Oh, I think I could see it from this angle. I don't think I can. Hmm. Okay, I'm kind of stuck. What the hell? Apparently this game likes freezing you. <laughs> I don't know if there's like a different colliders like, away. Unless I need to actually stand on the block. Yep. That's how you do it. Nice. This is uh, this is definitely crazy. It's actually a pretty good uh, first-person puzzle game. Um, there's, you know, there's no bullshit really. You just jump in and you need to get to the end, and uh, you're kind of given the mechanics a little bit, and you kind of learn them slowly. But uh, it's definitely a uh, interesting game. Um, I've never really seen anything like this before in terms of kind of like the mechanics of it. It's definitely unique. And again. It looks like it just gets increasingly, increasingly more difficult as you go along. I mean, I've not really been playing it that long and already it's like, holy shit, what am I supposed to do? I guess I can bring that one down. Right. Oh nice, that works. That works. Oh wait, that does not work. I wanted to bring that down, but... Why does that not work? Is it because I'm standing here? Oh, maybe if I stand here... Well, that would work because I'm not standing in the open, but I guess not. <laughs> yeah, 
This is confusing as hell, man. Oh, wait, there's one here too. Now, as you can see, it's like... It gets more and more puzzle -like. Ah, I can actually do that, I think, if I can get across there. Or not. God damn it. That does not work. Oh, man. That kind of works. That works. You've literally got to fold in the whole thing on yourself. It looks like me. Like, I don't know. Yeah. Something is completely wrong here. This is crazy, man. Some of these are probably going to take a while to do. Especially when you haven't got a clue what you're actually doing. I mean... Where's the exit again? There it is. How the hell am I supposed to get up there? I need to kind of figure out a way. Um... Can I do it from the side? Apparently not. Apparently not. Damn it. That kind of works. Um. That's what. That's the ones I need to bring. That's the ones I need to bring. Cross, but where do I stand for that? Can I stand here? No. Like, do I need to be in this corner? Like, I don't get it. Nope. <laughs> I'm really struggling with this one. Alright, that works. Alright, so there's that. Now I just need to, like, figure out... Yeah, I don't think I can even do it from this side now. Oh wait, maybe I can get around that. Let me try. Can I, is this it? Oh no, it's not it. God damn it. I mean, I can actually get up. Oh wait, I can get up. Nice! <laughs> Holy shit, that was crazy! That is easily one of the craziest ones I've done. You know, I don't even know how many levels are in this alpha, guys, to be honest with you. Um, I just wanted to take a quick look. Um, I'm probably going to leave it here now. This is Fabric. It's a first-person puzzle game. If you haven't already noticed by me being completely silent trying to think through these puzzles, definitely not the easiest things I've ever played, but, uh, you know, obviously the more you play, the more you learn, and uh, it's a pretty good mechanic, to be honest. I'm actually enjoying it. I would like to see more of this, but uh, as even as it is now, as in like an early alpha prototype, it's still pretty substantial, pretty good. You can have a good time, it's pretty challenging. And uh, yeah, if you just want to kind of mix it up and uh, play a first person puzzle game, then you know what? Why not?
as you can see it's uh, definitely very challenging and uh, definitely worth a try so if you want to check it out link will be in the description this is this is free to play so you can just download this and uh, check it out but yeah there it is guys fabric thanks for watching and i'll see you next time